Welcome. Today, we're going to talk about a subject I often get asked about, which is how one can tell that a competitive advantage is at risk of coming to an end. What would the early warning signs be that things may be over? Here are some things I would look for. Firstly, if your company is investing at the same levels, or even more, and not getting margins or growth in return, that usually means customers aren't wowed by your offers anymore. If customers are finding simpler or cheaper solutions that are good enough, this can erode your ability to get good margins. You have to pay attention if competition is emerging from places you don't expect. In the transient advantage economy, competition is highly likely to come from other industries as much as it is from other companies within your own industry. If customers are no longer excited about what you have to offer, that often means lack of innovation and commoditization. On the people side, if you're not considered a top place to work by the people you would like to hire, that's not good. Good people go to companies that give them opportunities. Similarly, if your best people are leaving, that's also not a good sign. And if nobody's had a call from a headhunter in years, that means they don't think you have people worth poaching. Is your stock perpetually undervalued? Maybe the markets are trying to tell you something. Are your technical people, scientists and engineers for instance, predicting that a new technology will change your business? They usually see it coming first. Have very few of your innovations made it successfully to market in the last two years? That can be an indicator of slowing differentiation. And finally, do you suspect that management is denying the importance of potential bad news? Good companies are brutally candid with one another and bad news travels quickly. If you see more than three or so of these early warnings, brace yourself for a particular advantage to come to an end. That's the time to start taking action.